Joe Zekas from Yoshikago.com. I'm at K2K Station with the guys who are keeping things straight out here. I'm Jonathan. Uh, I'm with James Schaefer and Shimming. We're land surveyors and technical engineers. Um, basically, we run straight lines. Right now, we're, we're checking. We do this each week to check to make sure that nothing around the site right now is moving around checking the city's utilities, making sure there's nothing happening underground while they're doing the construction. Everything going smooth? Everything's been real good so far. Um, you know, they're, they're running their control up their building. They're doing the, the same kind of thing as they go up. They'll be running a line off of a point outside and, and running that line straight up. Basically, make sure the building is going up in the same spot all the way up as they go up. Have we seen one shift? Yes. Well, yeah. They they tend to they tend to move around. It depends on how tall they're going to go, and there's compression and there's settlement. You can have either one. As buildings get taller, they'll tend to compress and shrink. Um, and depending, I've seen jobs where they've had movement and had to stop the job. Things moving around the job, and they'll have to shore up figure out what's what's happening where they need to shore things up and then they'll start again so it's kind of a constant process what union are you with we're local 130 we're a plumbers union okay so they're plumbers and technical engineers how long does it take to learn your job <laughs> i don't know long, longer than i've been working than i, I mean I, it, I would say a, a, at least a good two or three years before you really are comfortable at all with it, but there's always more you can learn. That's um, and you've been at this 12 years, and you still uh, got more to learn. Oh yeah, oh yeah, definitely, definitely. Yeah, there's uh, that's one thing you always want to be sure that you're right, and you, you always have to question yourself. That's part of the job. You you never want to assume that you're right. You make all the checks you need to make, and make sure that what you're doing is correct. And it looks like uh, everything you're doing is computerized readings here. Yes, it is. Yeah, that's that's what that's today's day and age now. Uh, electronic equipment is mostly what what is used. It's still the same basic principle. It's a transit that runs a line um, and shoots a distance. Based on that, it'll give you a location of whatever you want to have a location for. Um, so it's all done electronically, but all the math and the principles are still the same. So not much different than when they built the pyramids, really. <laughs> same same concepts. A little bit more advanced, or the technology is a little bit uh, a little bit more advanced, but it's all the same principles.